fracture in five NFL games. The eastern seaboard is bracing for a powerful nor'easter that will dump a massive amount of rain and, in some locations, cause hurricane force wind gusts. A number of NFL games will be affected Sunday, and if you're brave enough to head to the stadium, you might want to bring a poncho. So how bad will the conditions be across the East Coast? Let's break down the forecasts, game by game. All forecasts via AccuWeather. Tom Brady and company should miss the brunt of the bad weather, as a high wind watch goes into effect at 6 p.m. with gusts up to 55 miles per hour expected. Foxborough is also under a flood watch beginning at 6 a.m. Sunday. At game time, there's an 11% chance of precipitation that increases to 26% by 4 p.m. Winds will range from 15 to 22 miles per hour. It will almost certainly be raining at Lincoln Financial Field Sunday, as rain is projected to fall steadily from 5 or 6 a.m. into the workweek. There's a 73% chance of precipitation at kickoff, which, according to AccuWeather, may be torrential, with winds at 14 miles per hour. With East Rutherford also under a flood watch, it's going to be very, very wet at MetLife Stadium. A 49% chance of rain in the morning ramps up to 78% by kickoff, with winds ranging from 14 to 20 miles per hour. The conditions in Buffalo shouldn't be nearly as bad as in coastal cities, but it will be cold. Tailgaters will have to contend with temperatures in the low 40s, with a 50% chance of rain, or higher from 10 a.m. until kickoff, eventually tapering to 40% by the end of the game. Winds should remain under 10 miles per hour throughout. Downpours are expected for much of the DMV area throughout Sunday, with rain forecasted from the early morning hours throughout game time, with winds around 14 miles per hour.